two more craft books for you guys. So, there are, both are concerning, not concerning, but like about crafts you do like in or around your home. So, and like within both of these books, you are going to be spending a certain amount of time and money on them. So, first book is hand, Handmade Modern Smart DIY Designs for Stylish Home by Ben Udia. So, now, these one have, like, pictures of, like, the materials, like, some of the materials you're going to use. And talks about like tools. And so this is your code book code page. And so you got like done at Home Depot, 3D printer, zip tie kind of thing. So and it goes through different rooms so like and I'll say what projects are in so this is the living room and like these are the projects and like a few pictures and so you'll have like the t the name of the project you got some sentences there estimated time so like for this one you got it's three to six hours so estimated cost, under $50 without legs, 100 with legs added. And then you got supplies, tools, and you have a note. And then you got like the plans, like a visual plan, and you got the steps, and you got the little codes there as well. So, and you have like optional, what can go wrong, alternatives, but if you don't want it anymore. And so you got the same basic setup for every single project. So, and then it goes like that throughout the rooms that it, are talked about. And so you are looking at upwards of like 100, close to 200, depending on the project. And like you got a few images as well. And yeah, so. After the last project, you got a metric chart and index and then at the end you have a few pages of notes that you can do so i got this at my local library so i for one not writing in it i usually don't write in my books anyway and next one more concerns with a uh, the garden green space of your place diy garden Projects, you see activities for edible gardening and backyard fun by Matt Pemmer and Dylan Sedic Ridden. So, again, like the last one, pretty thick book. And you got right off the cover, you got tools that you would like need for some of the projects. Then tricks of the trade, useful materials. So there, and then project ratings. So um, you got like clocks, like how long it would be, dollar value, and like um, a piece of cake with a cherry on top, a whole cake, no cherry, circle, circles into squares, plenty of finessing, but best not to show anyone how this is done, just show them the end result. So, those kind of writings. And, so, 
you got a few different categories like kids gardenings and then you got project lists and then like this is how like the projects are like set up and you got like the title and like those codes right there and then it's more like visual and if you like if you can photographs of making the project and you got a few different categories and like you can always tell what, what you're in there so and so you are looking at like a lot of some look like a lot of um, either like time or money wise or like eff effort. Um, this one is like this one is like all ones, but yeah. So. Like the with other a few other like books like this, it slightly different s setup, but similar to other projects that I've seen. So like. For me, I wouldn't get this just because, like, I got it from my local library to have a look at. But just how it's set up, I am not, like, not totally jiving with. Some people would. Some people would like how it's set up. So, there is this. And happy readings and... Happy crafting if you do get this book and you, you get one of the two books or both and do them.